I like to consider myself a pretty intelligent, competent human being. I have two degrees. I was captain of my university fencing team. I play the guitar. I read a lot of books. And on Monday, I got locked in a toilet for two hours. Okay, so I bought these really cool sunglasses and I really want to try them out. I think they're pretty cool. And if you think they're not, then fuck you, I'm still wearing them. Okay, so this has been a week of complete stupidness on my part. I am genuinely stuck in a car park. I have no idea how to get out of here. Ah, uh, I can't believe, like, literally this Monday. Okay, so here's what happened on Monday. I went to see a friend in Camden, as you do, and we had a really good time. We walked around, saw some stuff, ate some food, and you know, it was really cool. And then after we said goodbye, I went to a pub to just get some water, because I don't know if some of you out there know this about me, but I don't actually drink. So I had some water, went in, sat down, thought, okay, I'm gonna go to the loo, then I'm gonna go home. But I'm kind of desperate by this point, so I go downstairs, I'm kind of in a rush, I slam the door behind me, and I'm like, okay, take care of business. And then I look at the door, and I think that doesn't look right. There's something, there's something a bit odd here. And then I try and unlock the door, and it won't budge. Nothing I do is going to make this door move at all. Okay, it's fine. I can just call upstairs and they will come and rescue me. This is after 45 minutes of me trying to get out. At this point, at least one of you is thinking, but why didn't you just kick the door down? This is why. This is why. I was on this side of the door. So to kick the door... Wait, hang on. No, I wasn't. The door frame was on the outside for me. So this means to have knocked down the door, I would have had to kick the door through the hinges and the door frame. And I lack the physical strength to actually physically do that. So I started calling them up upstairs. I'm thinking, okay, be fine. A couple of calls and I'll be all right. I called them for another 45 minutes. And at this point I'm thinking, oh shit, I'm gonna have to call the fire brigade. It's like nine o'clock on a Monday bank holiday. Like, these guys might have already gone home. And then it struck me. I have an idea. I'll call the bar opposite and they'll come rescue me. I had to contact the barfly in Camden, which was opposite where I was. And I had to call up the line which is about, which said, if you want to book your band into our venue, then call this number. Needless to say, the guy in the other end was very confused when I said, look, mate, mate. I am stuck in a toilet right now and I really need your help. He was quite confused, but thank God he came to help me. I explained the situation, said to him, look, I'm stuck in the bar opposite you, please come and help me. And he was just like, mate, I mean, all right, but what the fuck? So I ended up with the manager of where I was, the manager from the bar fly and the bartender from where I was all stand outside the loo while I desperately try to hammer on it to try and get someone's attention. And they said, it's okay, we're gonna knock down the door. And I thought, bloody fantastic. And so they smashed down the door and I was freed and everyone laughed at me, which was entirely fair enough. This theme of stupidness is something that has carried on throughout the entire rest of the week. I'm actually glad today I got out and got to do some rock climbing and do something physical. This is one of the things I've been lacking recently. I've not been able to go out and do just physical, energetic things. I've kind of been stuck and not finding this rhythm of things I should be able to do. Normally I'm fencing three times a week, gym four times a week, maybe rock climbing once on top and I've been able to do none of those. It's kind of getting to me a little bit. Like, I've lost quite a lot of weight. I'm down to... 65 kilos at the moment when at my best I should be about seven well a good weight for me is about 70 I just said to my friend oh yeah well I'm climbing outdoors with some friends and she's like ah oh. Hope you don't find yourself in a rocky situation. Oh God.
Yeah, me too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't really notice it. <laughs> <laughs> There's more thought I'm not surviving this day.